Good afternoon, YouTube people and Silver Stackers. Now, today I am introducing Silver Otter. Silver Otter is my assistant today. He's also the guy who did all of that artwork. Go ahead. Hi, I'm Silver Otter. I love to draw, and I'm only 10 years old. That's right, he's only 10 years old, so don't judge him. Now, let's get on, yes or else. Let's get on with the unboxing. Now, the, this box uh, comes from the uh, Perth Bullion Company, again, as usual, and we shall slice it open, and hopefully not slice open ourselves in the process, because, well, let's face it, that would suck, especially live on YouTube. Now, I'll just get this, ah. So now this is the thing, this is the point in which I realize people pre-score all these packages so they don't have to go through this whole process and it doesn't look ridiculous. But that's all right. It's all in good fun. So, Otter, what did you do today? Um, you went to school, didn't you? Yeah. Did you learn anything interesting at school? Mm, yes. Okay, would you care to elaborate? Uh, no. Okay then. Straightforward and simple. Now, Otter, if you would be so kind as to hand me the gloves, we can get on with this unboxing. Now, the coins in here don't come in capsules, so we need to, oh, bubble wrap. And peanuts, have some peanuts. Yes. Oh, eat them, Chaos Monkey, yes. eat them. Eat them. Eat the peanuts. Eat the peanuts. Eat the peanuts. Eat the peanuts. Oh, see? Perth Bowling Company. Ooh. Whee! Yay! There's my invoice, which we don't need to look at. All right. Let's get this first one open. Let's get a pair of scissors, because we don't want to be... We don't want to be uh, slashing a sharp knife around. Let's get these freaking peanuts out of the way. Peanuts. Yeah. Woo! Peanuts. All right. Now here we're looking at some coins. All right. Now, as in a previous video, I showed you how to put your coins in capsules. The reason being is that we don't want to touch the coins outside of the capsules because they get damaged and it lowers their premium value. This is taking longer than I hope, so I'm going to pause it for a second while I unwrap this stuff. So here we are again. I got all those coin capsules out of their caps. Now, this is the first coin that we're going to have a look at. Now, Silverada, could you pass me the gloves? Sure. I want the gloves. Give me the gloves. Sure. All right, so as I put the gloves on, now, Silverada wants to know why you put coins in caps. Now, uh, would you or do you have an idea as to why you would do that? To stop the mark, uh, to stop your fingers making marks on them. Exactly. Yes. Well done. Got it exactly right. You did get it exactly right. Now let's have a look at this first coin. This is oh, look at that. So beautiful, so shiny. Look at that. That is a two-ounce Queen's Beast. Wow. Now hopefully this will focus. Look at that. Since 1999. Uh, Line of England, two ounce. Fine silver, two ounce, 2016. And the obverse has got a picture of Her Majesty on it. Two, five pounds. Five pounds. Look at that. Look at that textured background. See how it, Whoa. see how it's really super shiny in the middle and on the outside edge it's dull. That is awesome. Wow. That's a beautiful, beautiful coin. That is really, really nice. Now this is um, this is made by the uh, English Mint, um, and that is a beautiful, beautiful coin. So shiny. Now, could you pass me the uh, cap for the two ounce coin there, please? There, Silver Otter. No, those are the one ounce ones. It's the big one down the bottom. There you go. All right. So this goes in there like that. Actually, we need to use the other one. See how it's got a rim in it? Mm -hmm. And that coin sits in that rim very nicely. And then that goes on top of it like that. If I can ever get it together. And now, 
you can have a look at that coin and you can have a look So now you can have a look at that and you can show the people what it looks like, but you don't have to worry about putting your fingerprints all over it. See that textured background? Almost looks like orange peel. That's really nice. That's an awesome job. All right, now let's get on with the next ones. The next ones are from the Pop Joy Mint and these are the Silver Angels. Wow. Look at that. That is awesome. Look at the scroll work around the outside edge there. And that, I believe, is the angel Michael slaying the dragon, or is it St. George? I'm not sure which one. I can't quite remember. And this is made on the Isle of Man. And that is? Uh, it's one of the Channel Islands off the coast of England. And they have their own mint. And you see these little... See the see those little um, leg thingies, the three-legged thing. That's their emblem, or one of their emblems. It's an ancient Celtic emblem. And again, I'm not 100% sure. I'm sure somebody will probably comment and tell me. So this one's got to go in the capsule too. So you want to hand me this one, just like this, right? And that goes inside the lip on the inside edge. And if I turn it around <laughs> to actually put it in the actual capsule, and not on top like an idiot. Uh, <laughs> okay, technical difficulties. All right, let's try that again. Silver Arter pointed out to me that I was trying to shove a coin into an unopened coin case like the idiot I am. So, hand me a bottom there, little man. All righty. And I shall just come around here like this, touch this. And that goes in there like that. And then hand me the top, young man. There we go. Oh. Okay, now these cases are slightly oversized, I think, but, so you can have a look, have, have a look at that one. You can do that one on camera if you want, go ahead. Oh no, bring it back, let it autofocus, see, just like that. Yeah, there you go, tilt it out of the light, and then show them the other side. It's a beautiful coin on both sides. Oh, that's a nice looking one. What do you think of that one? Pretty and shiny. Pretty and shiny, that's right. Do, would you care to elaborate on pretty and shiny or just pretty and shiny? Just pretty and shiny. Just pretty and shiny, nice one. There's another one you can look at. You can put that, you can put that other one down if you want now. All right, you want to look at this one, that, that one, that one. Oh yeah, that one. That one. Good job there, Otter. Well done. And there's the last one. Mm. Look at that. That's really nice. Well, anyway, guys, thank you very much. I'd like to do a couple shout outs here. Uh, Coin Keeper, because she did a review on this big, chunky, two ounce. Queen's Beast, which we all got to have a really good close-up look at, so you could actually see it. And if you move your finger out of the wall, there we go, see? And that is a beautiful coin. Now, I'd also like to thank uh, Coin Couch for showing us the uh, Pop Joy Mint uh, Angel coins, because these are really beautiful coins. Look at that. That is just so well done. So shiny. It is so shiny, as Otter points out to me. Look at that. And uh, I'd also like to say um, shout out to Frank P. Newest Metals. Yo, Frankie, where you at? You got to do another video, man. Anyway, guys, uh, it's goodbye for me, Taz. And Silver Otter. And Silver Otter. All right, guys, uh, we shall see you on the flip side. Thank you very much, Mr. Corn. No, come back. Hey. Where'd he go? Where is he? Where'd he? Okay, actually, in real life, you wouldn't do that because he'd scratch up the caps and they'd look terrible. But anyway, all right, guys, thank you very much. Good afternoon. Be good to your mother. Be moral in your dealings with people. 
And I'd just like to say that uh, Otter's mother, Silver Widow, has been sick, so could everybody please send in her some wishes to make her feel better? Thank you very much, and we shall see you the next time.